Welcome back to Goal Info for you, your own psychology content channel. And this time we are going to discuss human resource management for undergraduates and graduate classes. It's more specifically for Pakistani universities. This time we have a paper solution in coming slides. Solution for the Punjab University question paper 2015 and its short questions portion. The question one is what is difference between job analysis and job description? The true answer is the job analysis in human resource management HRM refers to the process of identifying and determining the duties, responsibilities and specifications of a given job. Job analysis in HRM helps establish the level of experience, qualification, skills and knowledge needed to perform a job successfully and whereas job description is an informative documentation of the scope, duties, tasks, responsibilities and hard working conditions related to the job listing in the organization through the process of job analysis. Job description also details the skills and the qualification that an individual applying for the job needs to process. Question 2 asks, explain the concepts of re-engineering. Answer is, HR's process of re-engineering is all about increase, grow and continuous improvement. It is the fundamental rethinking and radial redesign that leads to an increase in productivity. The aim of process re-engineering is to improve the level of process performance in order to achieve significant and sustainable improvements in performance of your HR department. Through HR process re-engineering, HR professionals can rethink how they operate and find better or improved ways to provide HR services. Re-engineering includes few steps like identify HR process, understand as in process, analyzes as in process, understand problematic areas and develop to be HR process and then implementation. Next is explain validity. Validity is the degree to which a measure accurately predicts job performance. In other words, validity tells us whether the test is measuring what we think it's supposed to be measuring. Validity can be following types like content validity which means the content of the test items correlates highly with job content. Predictive validity which means the performance of employees or test score highly correlates with the future requirements of the job. Concurrent validity which means the degree to which test scores correlates with job performance and the last is construct validity which means the relations between the job and its scores and practical aspects. The next question is what is meant by human resource management? This is a basic one to know about HRM. The HRM is the management of the people working in an organization. It is subject related to the human for simplicity, we can say that it is the management of humans or people. HRM is a managerial function that tries to match an organization needs to the skills and abilities of its employees. Moreover, human resource management is responsible for, for how people are managed in organization. It is responsible for bringing people in an organization, helping them perform their work, compensating them for their work and solving problems that arise. Next question is explain intelligence tests. 
Interviews tests are described as the skill required to assess candidates' ability to perform specific tasks and reacts to a range of different situations known also as aptitude assessments or even perceptual speed or cognitive ability as some assessments they help to give a detailed understanding of how quickly a person will adapt to a new role these tests aim at measuring the general level of intelligence of the applicant this is done by measuring the iq of the applicant in addition this they also measure a range of abilities such as numerical ability vocabulary memory and verbal fluency that's it with part 1 of short questions of 2015 paper we will come back with another episode of this series very soon stay connected goal info for you that is aims for psychological content and moreover you can contact for help and guidance in psychology sociology education and hrm areas for the css pms a level a level and all graduates and undergraduate courses classes for university and board national and internationally like cambridge edexcel ap test etc thank you very much stay connected